this Wayne once again. Welcome back to my channel. I know it's been a while since the last time I sat and talked to you guys, but here I am. I'm back. I'll be sharing with you guys my honest review after using my phone, Xiaomi Redmi Note 9 Pro after two months. Some specs and some camera tests, gaming tests, and a lot more. Also, you my pros and cons. So, yeah, as you can see, this is my lock screen. Ayan. Today is March 11, 309. So, this is the front page of my phone. Call, camera, message, and the time. So, this is the second slide. COD, WPS office, notes, calendar, music, clock, calculator, file manager, gallery, setting. Then, after this toolbox of mine, ina-install ko na yung mga unnecessary apps na hindi ko naman kailangan. I'll share with you this one. Calculator. Sobrang cool lang kasi. You can have it as a floating app. Like this. Ayan. Then, you can move this calculator. Then, this one, ito, yung water drop na to is yung visibility nung calculator like this. Ayan. Or, ayan. Ganyan. And then, conversion. Ayan, like this. This one, yung share me. Gustong-gusto ko yan kasi para siyang airdrop sa iOS. Kapag yung Xiaomi to Xiaomi na phone, mas madaling mag-send ng file and maka-receive ng file. Tapos, all you have to do is scan the QR code na lalabas. And then, there you have it. You can send some apps, some photo, music, and videos. And tapos, Google. Then, some editing apps of mine. Then, socials. This is the notification bar. Some controls and the next one is settings. Let's go for settings and pinakababa muna. Yan. Service and feedback, location, privacy, accounts and sync, Google, me accounts, special features, digital well being and parental controls, additional settings, apps, battery and performance. Ayan. Ayan. Naka full screen mode ako. Ayan, ganyan. Or you can hide this. Ayan. Ayan nakita nyo yun, yung block na yun. Yun. Pala sa special features. Ayan, yung game turbo. Ayan, para pag maglalaro ka ng, ng games. Ayan, ganyan. mas optimize and then what else floating window ayan for example instagram and then yan that's the floating window where you can move and use it while, while doing some stuff like, for example, ito, calendar. Tapos, ayan. Ayan. Pwede mo siyang i-minimize. As you can see. Or, bigger. Ayan. Ganon. Then, the battery. Password and security. Ayan. Fingerprint dito sa gilid. Ayan. 
Ayan, yung fingerprint dito. Fingerprint and then the volume button. Ayan, sound. And then lock screen. Or you can change the time. Ayan, ganyan. Pero ito yung lagi kong ginagamit. Ayan, themes. Pag... This is Wayne once again. Welcome back to my channel! <laughs> And 
cons, to be honest, nothing much. Kasi I am very impressed and I'm very satisfied with my phone Redmi Note 9 Pro. Yung speaker, medyo nahihinaan ako kasi nga, isa lang yung speaker niya dun sa may baba. Tapos, to be honest, ang bilis niya talaga mag-charge. As in, first 3 days, sobrang bilis niya talaga mag-charge. Parang 20 to 25 minutes lang, full charge na. Tapos, nung mga 1 month na, nung inaobserbahan ko na, 45 to 50 minutes na siya bago ma-full charge. So, parang mga 1 hour, mga ganun yung range, bago siya ma-full charge. No? After a month. Tapos, yung battery life niya, Kaya siyang gamitin ng 2 to 3 days. As in, 2 to 3 days talaga walang charging. Normal usage of phone. Na mag-wifi ka, maglalaro ka, social media, YouTube, and all. Kasi yung battery niya is 5,020mAh. That's about it for this video. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe. On to the next one!